Hello, in this video I'm gonna show you three apps you should get on your R iPad Air 5th generation. So let's get into it. First one would be Duolingo and it's basically app for learning language easy way. So if we press get started we can choose the language we want to learn. So for example here I will use Polish. Uh, you can uh, say where you heard about it. You can just press other things. How much Polish do you know? I'm uh, intermediate or higher. Uh, why are you learning Polish? You can choose the type of like why you want to learn it. For travel, for example, I chose. And course overview, uh, continue. You can pick for how long you want to learn daily. I will use casual because it five minutes daily is actually can teach you a lot. So let's just continue and help us uh, find your level learning Polish for the first time. I already know some Polish and now we can uh, begin our tests and uh, stuff like that. So we can start uh, uh, you can uh, translate the sentence so the men have water. Uh, so you can uh, say men have water check and it's done so yeah that's a pretty fun app if you want to learn the languages the next app would be notability and from here you can create um, cool notes for yourself or uh, something to because when you just draw something or add a bit of color to your notes, it's easier to remember things. So you can um, write notes like today. I recorded I pad. And you can change colors, your pen, uh, do whatever you want with this and uh, notes. So they are really cool. You can uh, remember a lot of stuff by just uh, doing that. The next app is Velu and it's an um, app about wallpapers. So you can uh, like, this is the main uh, screen for the app and you can choose the uh, like theme. So for example, here I will use um, Enigma here and you'll be able to choose from all of these wallpapers to set it on your iPad in, and they are in the really high resolution and look just amazing. So we pick this one as you can see it's a very high resolution again and you just press here and your wallpaper is saved to your files. We can go back go to our settings find um, wallpaper Ch choose sorry choose a new wallpaper and from the recent we can pick the one that we just downloaded and press set set for both of the screens now if we go back our wallpaper is set and yeah the these wallpapers are really high quality i really recommend using it and that's it for this video, hope you like it, please consider subscribing to our channel, leave a like and a comment below.